Hello guys and welcome back to YouTube channel. I'm Paul Nyaloso. Before you continue, please just make sure you subscribe to my channel for more updates. Enable the notifications. So in this tutorial guys, I'll be showing you how to convert from one partition style to another. In this case, I'll be converting from master boot record to guide partition table. So before you do that, you must now confirm which partition style is of your computer or your disk is partitioned using which partition style so come to this computer if you are using Windows 7 right click on computer then manage you want to see which partition style which was used to partition this disk so click on disk management click on disk management then this is the disk that I want to convert so I want to convert disk 1 it's a uh, removable it's an external disk so that's where I click at that point so just come here at disk one properties then volume now in my case my disk was partitioned using the master boot record partition style so that's that's good so if you click at this point here you won't get the result that I'm showing you Let's give it a try. So click here, then right click on it, then properties. Let's wait. This now here. You can't see let's go to security. Ready boost, nothing. Cora, nothing. Customize, nothing. Hardware, there's nothing you can see there. Let's go again to properties so you must go to the properties so you have it here you see so that's what I'm showing you the only thing the only place you have to access it is just at this at the right point here where it's written disk here this point at this point so let's get going so let's again close this windows this window because you know now we're dealing with mbr so i'm going to use command prompt to solve this so and before you proceed please make sure that you have a backup for your data because this conversion leads to data loss so the only way to do this without data loss you need to have backed up your data you may use softwares and other things but you may mess up on the way and cost your data to be lost again you have other tips you can use to recover the data but let's go let's not go that far at the moment let's just solve it so you have to launch command prompt as administrator so right click on it then yes so i like using this color color a so here you type disk part press enter so I'll again type here i'll show you as i'm typing this notepad so you type this part this disk part command allows you to view the to access the disk so list disk this command now is used to view the available disks on your computer so 
if you have selected the disk so you will see a number of these there in my case I only have two the master boot sorry the master disk and the external disk that I want to convert which is of this size so when you're at this point just be very very keen on what you're selecting be very very keen please because this may lead to data loss because you may want to access another disk thinking that is the one that you've selected so here should be very careful so select disk select disk one here press enter so here you select disk so at this point to select the disk that you want in my case is disk one use it depends the disk that you have maybe disk two three four depending how you select it so disk one is now selected so at this point it's now where i was telling you you must have a backup for your information because you're going to clean and this clean command leads to wiping off your data so type clean press enter just may highlight them this point you can highlight this then select disk then clean These are the steps you guys have to follow so back here after selecting the disk then you have to clean clean the disk this is the command here sorry this here you have to do it so after that type this so that's that now means that it has been successfully converted to guide partition table so what you do at this point it's already been converted so here if you want to make it bootable so you can create type this command create part pre this part pre stands for partition primary so convert convert gpt stock and beer so here i've written in this format because it now depends with how your disk is so but in this case you're converting from MBR to GPT so you convert GPT again in the other video I'll show you how to convert from GPT to MBR create part pre this means partition primary press enter this part has succeeded in creating so this part has succeeded in creating the partition primary so these are now the things let me highlight them that you have to know So after that list partition list partition then the listing partition then you have to select partition so you select select partition 1 press enter so here after creating partition pre 
open list partition Then they've listed them, select select partition. So here we're going to have the option um, selected, so you have to format the partition. Format FS is equal to NTFS. NTFS quick. Press enter. So this command here format FS is equal to NTFS quick. This is now you're formatting the partition that you've selected. And this now here will allow you this command here. If you add quick, this means the formatting will speed up. So without quick, it may go to slow rate. So you come back here. So select partition. Then format the partition. Format the partition. Good. Now it's here. It's already formatted. So as you can see, completed. I've tried this some other time without using this this keyword here quick. Then the process took me a long time to complete. So after that, now. Let's now make it active. Type active. Press enter. Selected this is not fixed and we are oh it's the selected disk is not a fixed MBR disk. The active command can only be used on a fixed MBR. Okay. Let's now go back and see if it's formatted. Or not this if it's ready for use so now here with the removable at that time we're looking at it then it was an MBR so now let's come back and check let's see manage this they are one approve if it it's already changed or still not yet so I don't want to conclude to myself this one due to see how it is at the moment then properties then volume from there as you can see at this point it's now converted whoa we have done it Oh, I'm proud of this. I'm proud. This happened. So just let's quit. Type exit to quit the command prompt. So that's how we should do. So just a preview of this. Just a preview. We start at this. We started at this point here. We type this part list disk select disk clean convert create part pre then get part pre then this is another command you have to look at then list partition Select partition, format partition. Yep. Thanks for watching. Subscribe my channel for more updates.